what's up guys today is friday finally friday y'all know what day it is because today is snap on friday the very best day of the week because well obviously hamilton's here so let's take a look see what he's got you guys come on Finally. Finally, 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 Friday. I know, I'm glad when you show up because I know it's almost over. Suitcase. Just about there. Y'all having a suitcase promotion again? Yeah, I got a couple of them in. Those are cool. Yeah. Cool, I had a, cool, cool. A red one and a green one. I actually showed the red one and the green one both this morning. Got the yellow one left, and I think I got another yellow one and another green one at the house. That's cool. Might need to keep one for myself, because my wife ever kicks me out, I can put <laughs> both pair of pants and all three shirts in there <laughs> to leave. Well, at least you ain't got to worry about being homeless. You got a truck with heat and air in it. Yeah, so. this fuel bill ought to be then. <laughs> <laughs> Does your heat and stuff run off shore power so you can plug it up? Uh, no, actually, in the yeah. I run off of a heater now. I got the shore power, I mean, the uh, diesel heater. Yeah. The, uh, what's it called? S-Bar heater. Mm-hmm. And if we wasn't on uh, YouTube, I'd tell you what I think about that damn S-Bar heater back there. <laughs> <laughs> but, one of those trusty old tractor supply company, TSC, just bought a regular old $15 heater. Yeah. And run it off the power right here. Mm -hmm. Now, if it's not, if it's gonna be below freezing, I don't even hook it up because even with the onboard battery charger, the batteries will still be dead by morning to drain the, to the power inverter. But uh, I run this all day, or not all day, but for a few hours every day to warm it up back here every yeah. morning. If it ain't gonna be below freezing, I just leave it plugged up overnight and the battery charger can keep up. Well, if she ever kicks you out, all you gotta do is just, you just pull it in my shop. Yeah, use the heat from the just, shop. Yeah. <laughs> Leave the door open then that way. There you go. You don't get here in the morning like, what the hell is Hamilton doing here so early? Today's Tuesday, yeah. not Friday. You got an air mattress inside. <laughs> That'll be all right. We got direct TV and internet, so you'll yeah. be fine. You got good internet now, so at least <laughs> watch oh, uh, Tic Tacs or uh, Tic -tac. YouTube or something. <laughs> Tic Tacs. That's mm -hmm. what uh, I embarrassed my daughter with that. Of course, my daughter's 15. She's like this tall, everybody, so... Uh, when around all our friends asked if they've been doing that uh, Insta Chad or the uh, Snap Tags and all that stuff, <laughs> embarrass the crap out of her. <laughs> That's funny. Well, y'all ready for Christmas? I'm about ready. To, I've, I've been ready for it, but I don't buy but for one person, you know, just my That's wife, you I know. Mean. Just one. Now, my wife, I don't think she's ready for it. I think she's panicking about it. So I told her, I said, you still got like seven days to go, you know. I mean, we went eight last night for my son's birthday, then she left there and went and had to go buy some more Christmas presents. I mean, I think we're buying for all of Mississippi. <laughs> but. Well, my my ideal shop size is a uh, 120 by 80. Yeah. So if y'all want to get me something, that's what size I want. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think your wife shops like mine. I walked inside you all shop and I seen presents everywhere in yeah. there a while ago. I mean, like. Oh. I think it's just you and your wife live there. Your son's in the military, the other one singing country music somewhere and <laughs> got six hundred gifts. I yeah, got six hundred presents in here. I see it. But that's what I do. I just buy for the most important person. I buy for her and then let her worry about everybody else. Yeah. Thanks. Let, let her something. worry about all the least important people, that's you know. That's why that's I, I tell my wife, she's like, We ain't done Christmas shopping like I've been done. I done my stuff early, you know. I ain't my fault you wait till last minute. It ain't my fault yeah. you dragging butt. Yeah, she don't think this is funny, is that, but I'm being serious. I ain't being funny. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Well, did you find my my ratchet set yet? I got one on the way. I found one from another individual, and we got that bad boy on the way. Awesome. Looking forward to getting that. Yeah. It's pretty cool. I, he sent me a picture of it. He said, here it is on the way to you. I think it's actually coming out of Utah, the guy who has wow. the one that's sending it to me. That's a long way. That'll work, though. I'll take a Utah set of wrenches. Yeah. They all work the same, which they probably never even come out the package, honestly. Not but. here, they won't, no. Not the 100th anniversary. No. <laughs> For sure. 
everybody says I don't ever use my other snap on ratchets, but now you can attest I've oh, used them all. Yeah, they all. I just take care of them. Yeah. Now, I will say, Clay, he'll use, I mean, they'll be dirty and they'll be on one tray. And before he gets done, even his wife knows when she gets here, if she's ready to go home early, then you better get to the shop early because you've got to clean it some tools. Yeah. Before they go back in the box. Everybody's going to get a tires. bath of, with them. And I guarantee his wife knows how many cases of, a, how many tubs of double towels is in that shop. Cause. Well, you see my supply cabinet yeah. over there. I think I've got, I just got a new case. You know, they've been back ordered, the cases. Yeah, I tell so them about it. So I've been having to buy the individuals. So I just got a case in, so that's six tubs, and I only had three left on the shelf. Yeah. So. But I thought to close the shop down. That's it. Because, I mean, you can't clean the tools in. Yep. Yeah, they cost the, too much to mistreat them. I just can't. I ain't got that in my blood. The tubble ties, I, like I said, I order them by the case too. I just keep three or four on here at a time because mm -hmm. I don't sell them more than maybe one a day. So I just replenish them every morning. Yeah. And uh, But I was getting a little worried there for a little while. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> like I live by them things. Yeah. The, uh, actually, what they said, the woman told me is that it's the paper is the same thing they do yeah. the mask out of, and they got plenty of the solution. They just can't get the paper. Mm -hmm. I wish they'd sell that solution in a spray bottle, and that would be the end of. Yeah, like I would... buy that and use regular rag, you know. I think like... that's what they'd be afraid of, though. Yep, man, it it works. But they can do like the uh, you heard before about the hot sauce. Com didn't you? Like with the Tabasco hot sauce? Uh-uh. They tried to figure out like a long time ago, I'm not sure when it was, how to sell more hot sauce. And they brought all the employees in because they had all the engineers everywhere try to figure out how to sell more hot sauce. What can they do to sell more hot sauce? And the, one of the employees like put a bigger hole in the jar. They was like, that ain't gonna work. He's like, Cause they use twice as much of it. You have a bunch of extra on your plate and then, I mean, they ain't gonna save it. Obviously they wash your plate off. So I put a bigger hole in the uh, top of the jar, then they sold twice as so much of the hot sauce. Do the same thing with a spray bottle, just get their spray yep. bottle, have a big hole in it, and use, be like. Use more of it. Yeah, use more of it. And... Wouldn't somebody trade in a blue point light? They did. It works like a champ, too. You know, we kept one of these, remember back there by the back door? Yeah. And I kept it plugged up, and that thing run for probably three or four years back there that was the only light we had back there by the breaker box for probably three years <laughs> <laughs> was one of those that one the guy brought to me he uh didn't have the money for his payment and it's like every christmas from from about the end of around halloween toward christmas he will uh start bringing me tools for his payments and stuff i guess i guess it's better yeah. than repo them but he brought that to me and didn't work at the time and i was like does it work and he's like yeah i promise it works and it was, was the battery dead. still working it? Yeah. No, I, he just didn't have it charged up. I plugged it up, and as soon as I put, plugged it up, it kicked right on. Hmm. That's what happened to her old one was the battery went bad in it. And yep. It worked plugged up, but it wouldn't work unplugged. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it, work, it works fine. Or, but now since you said that, I don't know, because I ain't checked on that part. Oh, yeah. There you go. Look at there. Pretty good light to leave right here and let about 10 people bang their head on it. How much is that light? 50 bucks. 50 it, bucks. And I throw the charger in on it. That's cheap enough to have a a working light. Yeah. I like the flashlight part of it. I like the big lights. what I like about them. Yeah. Well, that's cheap. Cheap enough. I'll turn that thing on. If it's still running by the time we get the video done, I'll buy that joker. There you go. Because if it's still working, and ten I'll put to that in my pickup. 45 minutes, can't never tell. <laughs> Could be, uh, if, if it would have worked all through lunch, it would have been a good one. Yeah, I'm not sure if any of them would have lasted through lunch. <laughs> tell everybody about our lunch break today. Yeah, we left, like, every Friday. A lot of people know, but every Friday, me and Clay go eat lunch. I mean, we've been four years now yeah every friday we go eat lunch together most time is i mean sometimes it it might be 45 minutes but most time it's for an hour hour 10 minutes but we try to get back we got a lot of work to do 
I think the last three weeks we've been bumping two hours. You know, that one guy today, he's like, Are "Y'all off work after y'all uh, get done eating?" Like, no, nah, we gotta go back to work. You know, he's like, "Well, ain't y'all been here half a day?" And uh, which I mean, every one of them know us by now. <laughs> we go to the same place every week. Every week. And uh, eat the same thing. Same thing every week. But I was like, I thought y'all was off work the rest of the day. And I always got plenty of work to do. May not do it, but we got plenty of it to do. That's it. Yeah. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But they thought that was funny, though. <laughs> Our lunches, yeah, pretty soon we'll be like, get we'll there for start, lunch and yeah. leave after supper. I mean, they keep getting longer. <laughs> like, don't finish that ticket up. We got to order supper. Before yeah. We leave. <laughs> uh, y'all, y'all want anything else? Yeah, let me get uh, one of those shrimp burritos real quick. <laughs> Well, y'all got any Good hunting time. planned to do for Christmas? We're going to uh, hunt tomorrow morning and going to hunt Sunday morning uh, this week or weekend. I also got Christmas parties tomorrow and Sunday. Sunday we'll come straight from the hunting camp to the Christmas party. Uh, as long as family don't piss us off before then, then me and my son <laughs> might not show up. <laughs> you never tell. Don't put it past me because I don't, I mean... You ain't that kind of, uh, was it your father-in-law and them? Yeah, all my in-laws. I got the best in-laws in the world. My in-laws is great. And then, uh, but we're doing like my mother-in-law's side of the family tomorrow at 2 or 2.30, sometime around there. We, we'll be back to the house around lunchtime, 1 o'clock. So will be plenty of time to take a shower and everything. Well, the one Sunday is my father-in-law's side of the family. That starts at 12. Uh, and my wife already knows we'll be back from the deer camp around 12 or 1 just depends on if we shoot something or mm-hmm. and me and my boy may end up riding around on the side by side can't never tell what we're going to do so we get there when we get there um, but father son time more important than worry about a dang Christmas party with a bunch of other people I don't see but <laughs> two or three one, times a year you that's know? Like, like one or two times a year yeah that's true he's, uh, he's hardcore into deer hunting so we're going to do it to it. I see it. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Yeah, exactly. Well, what about y'all? Y'all got big Christmas plans? Nah, we got to go to her sister and some of our family, and that's that's it. We're going to do it all ourselves this time, so. I'm ready to get it over with. Yeah, like, need, <laughs> get back to regular hours and stuff, not like have to after, worry about it. After your little ones, like I look forward to seeing Caroline open her stuff and all yeah. that, but after that, I, w- I would I like know. to see some pictures of her, which I know you don't have plenty of them. But mm-hmm. yeah, I mean that's a beautiful little girl, and she's gonna be super excited oh, yeah. with the, about all her stuff I've not seen in here. And my kids are older. I got two teenagers. My son will be thirteen tomorrow. My daughter's fifteen. So when they're little, you can get a whole bunch of cheap stuff. Oh yeah, and get a whole lot of. They're yeah. bigger though. Yeah, it's like I mean, Andrew, he wanted the new iPhone, was it 12, 12 Pro, whatever, Max, 512, $1,500 phone. Yeah. So that's what he got for Christmas, and it's going to be like, it's like a, a one firecracker. It's, like, it's over with. Yeah. That's it. That's what I you mean, got. That's your whole budget right there. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. I remember when I was little, we got $100 was our budget. So, like, you would go through the Walmart catalog or Sears catalog and pick out your most, mm-hmm. you know, whatever you could get for the most for that hundred dollars, you know, and that was it. Like, if it was a hundred and five, I'm sorry, buddy, you're five over. You don't have to yeah, back up and go again. That. Yeah, you know? back up and punt. Try to look for something else. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Now everything is a. Uh, the older they get, the smaller mm-hmm. the toys get, and the more expensive they get. As a child. Christmas is fun and it's fun to watch kids but man now it's just like I wish I could just sit at home in my recliner and not do nothing yeah, for that what, day you know versus that's why I told I, mean, I tell Clay the story and I tell y'all you stay when my kids was little we'd go to like when they was three and five or two and four and four and six or now it didn't happen by the time they was that old but by the time my daughter was six years old uh, we'd have to we'd wake up. They'd open their presents. Of course, they get up at five thirty in the morning. You know, Christmas morning. They always gonna be mm-hmm. up early. How uh, you go in there open presents, and then we'd have to. They wouldn't be able to play when they got get ready and pack up and go 
over to my in-laws house go spend a couple hours with them over there then we'd pack up and go to my parents house go spend a couple hours over there and mm -hmm. pack up and go to my sister's house and go somewhere else and oh, it sucks. Go so to, yeah, all that my going, wife's going, grandparents going. and everything and my kids we was on the way home last night both my kids not last night one night when they was a little bitty started crying but they didn't get played their christmas presents all day long you know because it was in the car all day mm -hmm. that's what i told my wife i will never do that again yep. and that everybody knows where we live we got the youngest kids and if they want to see mine on christmas day they pack their tail up they come to our house and that's yep. how it's been every year from the time my son was four no my son was three my daughter was five um it's been that every year until this year and now my sister has a little girl that's seven years old that's why i told my kids and my wife i said I don't expect her to, mm -hmm. the little bitty girl, the baby of the family, to get up and have to do the same thing, you know? Yep. So we get up, we do our stuff. My in laws will come over that morning. We all cook breakfast and stuff at the house. And then we're on the, we'll pack the stuff up and we'll go to my sister's house because she got the little girl. And I don't expect her to do mm -hmm. the same thing that we always did. And uh, we'll go over there where she can play with her stuff all day. That's it. That's what, I mean, that's what it's all about anyway, ain't it? That's true. The little kids. The little ones, so. man. Yep. That's what makes it. I mean, if it wasn't for that, it'd just be another work day. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, just a regular day off. Yeah. It'd be true. Boy, the old light's still a burning. I can't believe it. It so probably I mean, cut off in like a minute. As soon as I turn you walk the camera in, off. So you <laughs> walk inside after you buy it, then <laughs> <laughs> dang battery go out of there. That's true. I'll take it. She's still a burning. Yeah. I'm mean, just as bright over here, too. That's good. I'm turning it that way a little bit. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I guess we're going to turn this thing off. I talked to Hamilton about some stuff that I was looking for, and uh, he's going to be getting an in for me, so it'll be something cool for you guys to check out after Christmas. 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 And uh, we'll start a new year. All right, guys. Like always, thank you all for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. Check over here. If you want some merchandise, cool tools and discount codes are down here in the video description. Like always, if you're not subscribed, take your finger and press that button. That's all you gotta do. One click and that's, that's easy. it. Y'all have a great week. If I don't see y'all before Christmas, y'all have a Merry Christmas. Thank y'all again. We'll catch you later. See ya.